Hi everybody, it's Jody here and welcome back to my channel or hello for the very first time. Welcome to day one of Jody's Week in Review. This week we're gonna do really quick videos, five of them, five days, five reviews, real quick, hopefully under five minutes each, on some products I've been trying out that either I just wanna review or you guys have requested. So today we are gonna do a quick look at some of the Sephora wipes that are on the market right now. This first one we're gonna take a look at is the Yazuzu Cleansing Wipes. They're supposed to smell like lemon. And the other ones we're going to look at are the Green Tea Exfoliating Wipes. So what I have done is I have slathered up my hands. <laughs> Most people buy wipes, first and foremost, if you're like me, I don't use wipes in a regular cleansing situation. I 100% use my wipes to remove the bulk of my makeup before I go in with a makeup remover or cleanser and move on from that point, just to get the worst of it off. So both hands are exactly the same to see how these suckers work out. We have a Kat Von D liquid lipstick, Kat Von D locket foundation, NYX liquid eyeliner, Marc Jacobs mascara, and a Suva Beauty, one of their metallic eyeshadows, which are usually murder to get off. So both are exactly the same. First off, the yellow ones, the Yuzu. When you feel these, these are just like a really pliable, soft, soft cotton. They're very, very saturated, even if you've had the package open for a while. The one thing I am gonna say, if you are someone with sense allergies, this is brutal this is brutal i bought these because of the lemon scent and how much i love the lemon scent but the smell on them is so strong and lingers on the skin for a long time that i can't use them on my face so i regularly just use them at this point while i am filming so this is going to be the zuzu so we're going to go one two three four the lipstick is still holding on we still have liner the sh eyeshadow is still showing up. Uh, it got off the mascara okay, but not great. Now here, moving on to the green tea ones. These are an exfoliating cloth. So this side is very smooth and soft, and this side is a little bit scrubbier. Uh, to be totally honest, I like getting that stuff off, so I pretty much always use the scrubby side. So let's take a look with this one in four swipes. One, two, three, four. Okay. So here's the difference between the two. Now the green tea one, the smell is a little bit strong on it, but not, not bad, not like the lemon one. It settles in the skin, but it's very, very fresh. And, and it doesn't um, assault my allergies or my, sensibili my sensibilities at all. I do enjoy the exfoliating ones. There's absolutely no trace of the foundation, the liner, the mascara. This eyeshadow will cling on till the end of days, so it is really hard to get off without a makeup remover. This is a little bit harsh, that scrubby side, to want to use it on your eyes, just so that you guys know, but I just wanted to put it on there for reference. Kat Von D lipsticks, once they've dried and sat down, you guys know those are serious and they are on there for good. So the fact that it got that much off of it, on top of that, every time I use it, my skin feels really, really stinking nice. So I will use it on my face, just avoid the eye area. As for the lemon yuzu ones, I mean, look at that. That Kat Von D lipstick doesn't even look like I did anything to it. I still have traces of both the mascara and the liner on there. If you look close, you can still see. Actually, I can feel the texture of the foundation still on there. And that eyeshadow still almost looks good enough to wear out of the house. So quite frankly, when it comes to the lemon ones, I would say no go no go when it comes to these ones with the extra scrubby pad if you want some serious removal makeup wipes as far as I'm concerned there are really good ones and there are really bad ones and then there's a whole lot of middle of the road for me honestly especially for the price point these ones are middle of the road there are a lot of great great makeup wipes out there yes these might have a little bit more skin benefits skincare benefits to them but as far as I'm concerned I have my actual face cleanser my serums my moisturizers my mask to take Take care of that for me and when it comes to a wipe i just won't get the shit off my face uh that's it for this little review i'm giving them kind of a thumbs down for their price point they just don't wow me like i am not wowed by these i'm not super impressed and they will not be a repurchase so that's it for this review if you guys have any questions comments concerns leave them in the comment section down below other than that guys you know the drill out give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed already. And as always, guys, I will see you all next time.